Gadaim, Gada by faith, and peace and harmony. We pray that the victims that have been affected with this death virus succeed in the more in the name of Jesus. Father, as they are free, free them forever. As the minister have said, it's prayer that will keep them. May the blood of your son Jesus be upon their faces, upon their soul, the body, in the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you. We pray that everyone here has an advice given to us. We resonate inside of us. And we be in with that God in the name of Jesus. We go in pain and peace. Now for the Lord. Thank you. Thank you very much. Any volunteer for the Muslim prayer? Chair for today's event, the forthright social development, equality, gender expert, and activist. I really stress the word activist because they leave no stone unturned. Wherever there is inequality, wherever there is injustice, they are always there. The one thing also I found out, she is also a professional social planner. She has very well advanced skills with an experience of over 35 years. She studied in the UK, both for her master's and other certification related subjects. She worked, she's been working in Sierra Leone for over 35 years, and of course, with other African countries. She was very much involved in the disarmament, the mobilization, and the rehabilitation of our people during the war and after the war, over 28 
years ago. She has been the corner peg of our development in this country for over 25 years. Not only as a consultant, but as an expert or a person that we can always see someone to go to. And because of those reasons, having all those qualities behind her, it pleases His Excellency, the President of the Republic of Sierra Leone, appoint her as our Minister for Development and Economic Planning. Ladies and gentlemen, I would humbly like to present to you our chair of this very important occasion, Minister Kenya Bale, a social planning activist and a development expert. You're very welcome. Thank you. Now, my intervention is going to be very short because you spent, I think, about 10 minutes introducing me. <laughs> First Lady, Madam First Lady, Minister of Social Welfare, Minister of Social Affairs, Minister of Education, colleague ministers, the EU representative, <coughs> the resident coordinator, AI. Ladies and gentlemen, the Minister of Social Welfare is reminding me of Creole. Talk Creole. Uh, but I, I choose for Talk Creole, uh, the chair of this occasion, so I can choose the medium. But I allow anybody who want to talk, uh, Manuel, you know, get for talking Creole. But anybody that comes up here, and because of the non Creole speakers, between Creole and English. Um, sometimes I slip into English anyway when I'm speaking Creole. But, so I would use both mediums as well. But I would like to say that today is a remarkable occasion. And the reason why, why I say the occasion remarkable is that the problem where we face problem where no country for one face. But the reason why it's remarkable is that we as a country, as a government, and the lead ministries then don't react so quickly to the problem. Ministry of Social Welfare, Ministry of Internal Affairs, they get so many problems for dealing with. They get the, prob the, the problems of the prisoners, rehabilitation, they've got the problem of people where they live with disabilities. That particular ministry gets so many problems, both ministries. Then you go find out, say, the first lady also, if they support those when are victims, those where development don't left behind, those where get not get voice for talk, in are the voice of the voiceless. But of all these voiceless people, out of all the victims, we choose to put those way affected by drug addiction, drug abuse first as a priority. And we there will see the graduation of 40 rehabilitated victims in a very short period of time. It was only a month ago that we launched the program. And for this reason, I talk say this program remarkable. And we hope in written ever we get for do for address the plight of victims in this country, we go able to continue for do at the same speed. I don't want to take up too much of the time because we the chair and I don't really take that advantage. But I just want to say that you see the, 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 the we at the high table and the three women at the high table we all no, no, no. we know no mother 
go leg in the king for being a victim of drug addiction. No father also. That's why we're here. That's why we took the time on a Saturday afternoon to be here. At the same time, at Timapia, as the Minister of Planning, and me as the guardian of the president in agenda of the five game changers. Now, if you look the big five game changers, and I think say most of you know them, Feed Salon, Human Capital Development, Youth Employment Scheme, Technology and Infrastructure, and Rehabilitation or, 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 or Transformation of the Public Service Architecture, you will see that youth, they are the center of this agenda. When we want Feed Salon, Say we want youth for day out of the farm and work. Human capital development, we get what we they call the demographic dividend. When are the young people now the human capital in this country? But if we do not have the necessary quality youth in terms of skills, in terms of training, in terms of social cohesion, then social capital development will not work. Youth employment, we they try for create both public and private sector five hundred thousand jobs for you. If the youth not fit for work, if the youth are under the influence of drugs, if the youth have to drop out of university, then the agenda could be end. Technology and infrastructure, we know that youth get for to drive the technology industry in this country. So where? Is our agenda going to be if it's lost to the youth of this country? Another reason why Atimapia. So we all, we all, we all get to get that interest in ensuring that we begin them to give of the best. We get to drive this menace, menace of Kush out of this country. And this is not a good first step. So I congratulate the Ministry of Internal Affairs, Education, and also uh, drug, drug rehabilitation, gender, and all of those social people for this. So with my opening remarks, we will now proceed to the rest of the program. I thank you. Agenda invite the Minister of Social Welfare to welcome we Naya. Minister of Social Welfare, this is Melrose. Resident Coordinator AI, United Nations Resident Coordinator AI, our distinguished survivors and champions of push. And gentlemen, let me stand on existing protocols because if I am going to mention, I will call everybody here, but of course not to forget about my dynamic staff at the Ministry of Social Welfare. Today, we 
they can't talk, what they talk about Creo. Because this issue here, he went away for Yeri. Now, he may could not decide say that will left English us. And I want to ask kindly the EU ambassador, I guess you are getting our Creo. It's a bit small, small, not a small, small. And uh, AI, you are getting it small, small too. Good. So, today we gladly for the Nayasu. Because something don't begin at the country, we as a people, we don't decide for take them head on. Because the way we think they, if FIBA like, not think we, we they can say we destiny, it did not we own hand. Like where we all know, not only the first and this, when they get issues then like this, we don't get pandemic, not also, we don't get um, we don't we don't get corona, Ebola. Now a drop pandemic now we don't get. And God the help we as a people will be able for fake corona and Ebola and the corona will country. But not also so now so with the fat drop back. Kush. This kush. Kush for us. Kush for us. This kush here get for go. This kush, if you don't go, no problem. And we all sabi that they not so. Now the reason that they make where this kush business begin, His Excellency the President, he not waste no time in the cabinet. He call every cabinet minister when concerned. He said this will not for take an interministerial approach for FETA because every ministry, every agency, every department of this country get a role for play inside the fight against Kush and when a drug and we can also say drug and substance abuse. He said we get a role for play. So quick quick time we put ourselves together. The Minister of Internal Affairs now he gets one big role for play itself because this push business or the drug and substance abuse business, it also deal with law enforcement. Not also. We all know that this country will be in a law country. We know they just, we know they live in an animal farm. We know they just do crap and they do things so. We they live under law. So now the Ministry of Internal Affairs, when they under the National Drug Law Enforcement Agency, uh, they, and the man when at the director day, the executive director, Mr. Jaya Kai Kai, we all know, a dynamic person, where itself, he don't play big role. We get the police, where even now, when they see, when they witness arrest, the way they go on. So clearly the president be right when he say, now interministerial, not so one person. The Ministry of Youth, they get big role for play, because now they get the youth funded. I make even today. Yeah, for the full up with the with my, youth man them. Because message them day when now they're supposed to get them. A ministry of youth. We also get the ministry of health. Where this thing it links so much with health business. I make for we where they see them big big pen that day. We have the point. Because definitely there is a clear line, say the drug abuse. It linked with uh, 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 health issues. Now, I mean, the Ministry of Health said they get big role for play. So we all put ourselves together, quick, quick one. Of course, my own ministry. When we now, now for rehabilitate, the, the one that will not fall victim. But pandemic the president be very clear because arrest them be don't begin. Before November 26, I vividly remember. But who arrest them or push it don't happen? When they be then a Panema Road. When me and uh, retired uh, Brigadier Tanuva, we be the uh, Ministry of Youth, we be take a talk for go for go see them one day. day. President said we forget the chance because they are victims. He said the one that will get the problem, not the one that will they can send the, 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 the push, the one that will they traffic into this country, the one that will they mix them, the one that will they make money out of the life. Of citizens, especially the family one. <laughs> President said, 
Now they were now they will need for address the issue. So they were now with the grab quick quick one with the support of NTLA and the Ministry of Internal Affairs. We all we go now the link now now different communities where we form with them for help for raise awareness. Very shortly for some of now we don't see the video, but my excellence did not see the video yet, and some other people we go can scream and quick quick one work of what I don't I ask for now we see some of their community engagements. What we don't what we don't begin to for sure now say God maybe don't begin to take action because if the world get the town hall meeting recently now be too many people that concern say uh, probably government not don't do much but government is working and but who talks say now community led approach now for it and then we begin with some of now we don't watch the video we go there now so so me that day they said I'm not able for if it is the way when it has to boil when I know say Families are going. Yes, mama, papa, the kid, all now involved for push. The one that get big, 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 Yes, in the communities. That's all we able to discover that day. And that's all we take the nurses back. We can go first aid for help for treat some of them. And then we make the referral. Quick, quick, quick. Now the government hospital. Now there we able for identify. Then we champion the yard today. Then we survive of the yard today. Now inside the community today, we pull on another so? Yes, ma'am. Now they will pull them. But let we see say, let how the president not talk. Let we give chance. Let we give chance to them. Because most of the way they are now, then they are within the age bracket of uh, 15 to probably 25 or so. Yes? They are over there and so. Now very, very young people there. When they are potential, where is excellence in the president in five big game changers? And that potential. His excellency in five big game changers. Now this country, big uh, salon, we're not the biggest one. We're not going able, we're not likely for achieve them. Now I make the minister of planning, then I ask so. We're not likely for achieve them the, if we let the youth here go down so. And government not ready for that one. Because the loss will go lost, even in the economy. Look at the Doyana. Already, the world they go through very hard times. The world they go through. Zalo is no exception. We don't go through, we they go through. So if we left the youth there back, very unproductive, how this country would be. I'm glad for you today where you come, Mama First Lady, because you, your advocacy, you, you know that go, go come. And it always stay but issues the way no say, they affect. On a lot of platform. <laughs> on this Saturday, if you're supposed to join in man for go across and do for go do other things, it's an appointment plan. You say no, and it can't inside that push business day. I make you see cast in Donna Asso today. And on a lot of this is for our question. For how to address some of them in the Asso. We don't try, we young. And as a government, we continue for try. I make His Excellency the President for Una we not done yet. I know say most people they don't know say now don't form a tax force. Not also, it don't form a tax force like I been do for Corona and Ebola no more. For that tax force day, now in now they work with we all now the ministry the and department for make sure say we put this under control. Just like I will put the Kush, I mean just like I will put the Ebola and Corona under control. So President don't make that pronouncement. They don't say that a state of emergency in the past. When they call state of emergency by any country, a serious business. Now awareness time, now conscious time, now very serious business. Now in April, then I ask you today, on a Saturday, but serious business. We then I ask because for right before even president they make this pronouncement, when I just on the fourth, um, now when was it, the 11th or so, when he make this, the fourth, when president make this pronouncement here, we already be done get to the rehab center. Now, haste in Siana, where we don't care the way I will pull that community. For go for try for see how we go able for rehabilitate them with a lot of training for the social workers, for the uh, uh, health professionals, for the uh, drug drug addict specialists. Them a lot of hands we come together. When we are so there were they are so today. Of course, we give a big kudos to the Ministry of Defense. We get. To now they make together facility 
Yana, any good who gets the facility within that, 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 that uh, military base thing. Because what they do, the, the, when they win a big thing, when they take that push thing, you get for get security around them. Because when we begin, now about 51 you care for them. We get about six or so when we get for escape. Why? Because they're not the understands it. They want to see them by the drugs. But when the military, they come in and provide the necessary security, then the service provider, the Ministry of Health come, then they give them drugs, the NDLA, they come, then they give their own specialty, of course, with social workers, then with the counseling sessions. We even get a home mother and a home father. Then we get a home
Now they roll down. They just play that role. Thank you. And so today, later on, after we don't reach the, the height, we will get to can hand them over to the necessary ministries then. Who side they say they want for what is it? The one that want to go back to school, basic education there. The minister there, we will hand them over. The one that will want to go back to university, higher education there, then we'll get for TIFA. The one that will want to do training, the Ministry of Youth, then there. Some they want to do mechanical work, defensive, they train people there in that. We will hand them over. So it is all organized in that way. And as I speak to Una, we also get a list of the one way to wait to enter the rehab center. And these are the ones. This one there, now many university drop out, second year, third year, any cobra way you read and you have to bleed. Collect them many people. They take the third year and a college now. You will never say they can't come out for so can't help me. They drop out. They end drop. You have to put. So that one day, now then we they prioritize first and then school begin it. The one will be the SSC for just taking was down. SS2. They all they are registered with the Ministry of Social Welfare. And we they work with the partners and all the other ministries, the NPL, everybody for not make sure say we tell them go to the rehab center. Then are the priority now because value for money. They were at the edge now where they will come out and be productive. So we cannot leave them. They are the first ones we are taking after this batch. We are, we are taking them by next week. As soon as we complete all their filing and everything, then they go back to the rehab center. So, do you have the family? We allow trust the government. The government is doing very well, and we will continue. Some of you are not paying We're not paying up for nothing, but just for support the people. So that at the end of the day, we all will be proud to say we are Sierra Leoneans. On that note, let us take me seat and thank Una Agukamba. Thank you, thank you, Minister, for your power-packed welcome address. A welcome address where you don't cover everything, that even if we don't get any other speakers, we will not with a lot. But the bottom line, one of the already he emphasized, is that the government is working. President, instead a state of emergency, set up a task force to get the rehabilitation center on our way they graduate and then we get more when we they take in. But they also emphasize, say, we do do them together. We do do them with the partners, we do do them with the, the, the graduates here today. By morning grace, we will kick, push, come out completely in our family. Now we, we go on to, I think we, we can't get video clip. Clip, uh, yes. Who's for the video clip right now. The technicians. We suppose for sure video clip, if we're not ready, we will go on to the next statement. So whilst we wait for the technicians for set up for the video clip, uh, we go Yeri uh, remarks when we will start the statements and we start off with the UN resident coordinator who is also the UNFPA <laughs> resident representative. And in that capacity, UNFPA self don't support this program as well as the whole system. So if they are they wear two hats and the interventions into this has been doubled.
He holds her now, make, make, he don't help her, make the kids speech. We put her on pause. better now. Uh, I also should apologize that I'm speaking in English and not in Greek. Uh, but I was saying that I would like to commend I hope you can hear me better now. Yes. So let me start again. Uh, I would like to commend His Excellency the President for announcing a national emergency on drug abuse and addiction for establishing a high-level task force to galvanize action across sectors. Um, the declaration of an emergency is really uh, a special milestone and an important milestone in beginning to turn the tide against the drug crisis, which is a crisis in Sierra Leone and in many, many countries around the world. abuse is a very complex issue. It's an issue that devastates individuals, devastates their families, and devastates society. It's an issue that robs young people of their lives, of their health, and their well-being, and denies societies of the contributions of young people. As we've heard today, it's also an issue that threatens achievement of national development goals. I have to apologize for the mic, but I hope that you can hear me well enough. Um, so this is an incredibly important issue for all of us to act on together. We know from evidence from around the world that the most effective responses to drug abuse are the ones that put people at the center and are the ones that compassion and protection of human rights. The most effective responses are the ones that deal with root causes and ensure that we focus on prevention so that young people can continue to say no to experimenting with drugs. The most effective approaches promote treatment and rehabilitation and at the same time uphold law enforcement. Treatment and rehabilitation are truly, truly critical for ensuring that responses to drug abuse are holistic. And in this regard, I would really like to commend the Ministry of Social Welfare and all partners across government. And all partners for establishing the Drug Rehabilitation Center in Hastings. I was very honored be at the, the launch and establishment of that center in February, and I'm even more pleased to be here today because I can see that the impact that this center is already having. So, to our 40 young men and women who have just been discharged, today is about you. Today is a moment where we celebrate courage that you have shown in seeking support, for the courage you have shown, and your determination to really turn your lives around and to take this next step to make the future what you want to be. 
we know that the road forward is not always going to be easy. You will have challenges, but you are not alone. Please make sure that you are constantly thinking about the positive influences in your lives, looking to the future with optimism, and reaching out to those who care about you. You have the strength to overcome the challenges that you will face. I also want to join the ministers in really encouraging you to be ambassadors and to be champions in your community to help other young people. help other young people to say no to drugs. Today, I want to wish you and your family all the best for your journey ahead. We recognize the difficulties you've been through, we applaud your courage, and we look forward to the future that you will carve out for yourselves. On behalf of the UN country, in partnership to end the zero crisis and to ensure that we are working together to contribute to a better future for all. I thank you very much. Thank you. Well, we get another hand. So you must play uh, two roles, both as the UNRC and the UNFPA uh, resident uh, representative. Uh, I don't think Polly Mimse, eh? Nadia Rashid. Thank you, Nadia. And we encourage Muna. See, we, we, we are, as adults, what in, what in is saying, the philosophy, no, what the philosophy is, we not own this earth. We not own this world. We just fall out, but we begin and grab the kid there. Una get this country. We just call out for you, for Una. And we don't know how each of Una come into this situation. Everybody in story different. But waiting, he assure Una say, when I get hope. And waiting, we can assure Una say, we day with Una. So with that, we will go on to the next speaker, the EU ambassador. Your Excellency, the First Lady of the Republic of Sierra Leone, Honorable Ministers of Government, the representative of the United Nations system, um, representatives of uh, MDAs, and uh, of course, especially greetings uh, to those who uh, are survivors of Kush and are here and witness the success um, of their rehabilitation today. Padidem, uh, Fambuldem, Bunakabu. So I apologize also that I switched back to English because I think you will understand me much better than I use English. Uh, first and foremost, let me um, commend uh, the government's activity against uh, the push and against the danger of drugs. Um, this is indeed um, a very, very important fight that the international community has been done on a worldwide level since the 1960s when the International Convention Against Drugs was signed and uh, is still valid. During this time, a lot has been done on a worldwide basis against drugs. However, drugs are still there. And uh, this is why it is very important to ask ourselves about the underlying issues which lead to drug abuse. And um, I'm convinced that if I compare the situation 
in the countries I'm standing here for, 27 EU member states, uh, but also many other countries in the world, and what we experienced during uh, the years since the 1960s is that if there is a demand for drugs, then there will also be an offer. Um, so the offer follows the demand, and therefore it's very much important to better analyze and understand why people take drugs. And there are different reasons, of course, there might be individual reasons, there might be psychological reasons, but there are also social reasons. And especially a dire socio-economic situation also brings many people to take drugs if there is not so much hope. And therefore, it is very important what the government uh, does with um, the big five enablers. Because this is about um, how to bring hope also to the country, how to bring social economic development to the country. Agriculture is very important, it creates jobs. Education is very important, it enables people uh, to find a better future. And therefore, the European Union will continue to support the government in the implementation of the Big Five, especially in the area of agriculture and uh, of education. And um, I think these are the right priorities which have been set by the government. We will also continue, like other donors, to give uh, support in uh, the regional uh, and international fight against uh, drugs. Um, the European Union has been supporting projects of the West African Police Information System. This is very important for the cooperation of your country uh, with other countries on um, the regional aspects also of uh, drug uh, smuggling. And uh, like many other international partners, the EU also gives on the international level a support to the World Health Organization, which is also of use to the countries in West Africa. And we will together uh, continue uh, to support the development of your country. So now, um, let me come uh, back to you. It's your day, it's the survivors. And uh, yeah, gladly for you. Yuna ambassador them for the right way to go. Push Kamut completely. And you can help your country for can help your country for uh, for better. You can help your country for for being better. And I'm very, very Glad to see you here and to see your engagement. Down there, we don't talk about the trafficking, but this now, how did they stop uh, 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 the drug business and the kush business in our saloon? So I hand you over to Mr. Dara the man in the forefront of the drug Thank you very much, Madam Chairperson. Your Excellency, the First Lady, and all here present will allow me for a stand on existing protocols. We're glad for the air this afternoon also. Yes, sir. We're not going to go far also. Yes, sir. But the most important thing we are going to say right now, let we all as a nation thank the beloved President, President Bio for declare the health emergency on drugs. <laughs> this is a show as president a commitment to this country. One thing where everybody is here for, President Biodo always fight for Sierra Leone. He always does sacrifice for this country. Now in that same way they he see and fit. Say the only way we go for fat and drug push come on at this country. Now we declare health emergency so that all we resources them as a nation 
we all like the country tie we are and come together for make sure say we drive Kush come on at this country. Not only Kush, but all the other illicit drugs them we scatter all over the country. So to the high table and Madam First Lady particularly, we're really glad you were there this afternoon. We know say you always don't care and you always don't be like the forefront when it comes to the well-being of the citizens there of Sierra Leone. We thank you for that. Man the man there. But our first lady, the third way would have gone all the community there. The face is the one that they see so now. But I see the mother's face, they don't flow. Mother, I declare. Mother, I mother voice declare also. Yes, sir. And Nadia, as she talked earlier, as she said earlier, I don't see the year crew up, I don't see Nadia. <laughs> now we all know they have been going to launch the rehabilitation center. That day they after we don't launch the rehabilitation center, we go meet with brother and sister. Man, they have to be one. <laughs> because they never one for the day. So man, they cry, say, I want to go back to the house. So man, we all came for, for one night. So man, they talk about the bikini. One the sister there is having himself with the wife himself now now. He begin to last for week. He said bikini the no, they, 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 they school. He won't go back to a bikini. But today, as I look you, look where body don't find. Because what when they get by this push business, they're not a feel for new man and woman business. So man on the three, four years they know us. Now that right? And you be talking saying this also go to talk to those. So. Yes, but on a very serious note, we all get for time we oja as a nation and as society. For make sure, say, we dread drug come on at this country. Yes, now the big elephant, the big elephant at the room, now Kush. And Kush, I can tell people them, now the most addictive drug with it. All they go around the communities them for raise awareness, for do sensitization. The beginner they tell me, say, so man, they say this thing, get on the world. So man, they say this thing, get you do. No, so? Yes, sir. But what do you have to tell you now? I know they tell you, I say, not to on the world business. Yes, sir. I know they tell you, I say, not get juju. Yes, sir. Now the addiction, I will not be described as juju or on the world. And we tell President Leo, thank you for the newly appointed coordinator for the National Tax Force on drugs. The person where they appoint, the person where we all go work with. Because the person where we in capability. For me, I can always tell people that that up to now, me are still more so German than lawyer. And the person now where they can't leave this fight, now a doctor, now a military man, now a person where I very well, and a person where we will work very, very well. So we have promised the country, we have promised the nation, that once we all come together, once we all work together, we go to say no to Kush. No, sir? Yes, sir. We go to say no to drugs. Among with Naya today, you get some of your brother and sister there, when they're overseas. You get George Alpha Naya, all the way from Delaware and America. You get your organization. One way or the other, everybody, even the one way they're out, 
Madam First Lady, they all don't decide for not all join together for fair this war on drugs. As you don't know with my brother Habib. Habib don't deal with me now, all the gutters, then the whole them. No side on the whole don't go away, Habib no day. With your own people there, with your own work man there. The Ministry of Social Welfare, the social workers there. Most of them are there this morning. My office, the National Drug Law Enforcement Agency, the Ministry of Youth, Ministry of Internal Affairs. I want to really say thank you to them all for the sacrifices the whole don't make for all who they this hall today. They told me where they graduate today. I just want to remind you now, all they say that this now, and even all can I do here, I tell you now, that now all are going to the communities there, the temptation all are there for face, it gets for head, you know so? But what do I tell you now for do? Pray. Government, they do everything in your power and capacity for help you now. But all that they go back to the communities there. The one thing what they go take you for, not to the same community that they go back to. I know they say, Kush no day again, no. But the work of IG, uh, Fire Cell, the IG, the work of the NBLA, and every two of them in the last couple of weeks, no day, no day, no they make arrest. Will they go after the one where they bring a camp? Will they go after the one where they sell up? And I make one of the things where I want to let everybody know that this hall, or you want to list your TV, will not get no more safe haven or safe side for Sudan for do drugs in this country. You will allow your compound for be used for picking them for Sudan, the Lord. You now are able to that law. You went in a community where they rent your host, give person, where they go sit down there for manufacture drugs, for mix the chemical. There. You said liable. But the one thing I tell Una this morning, that the best way for keeping a drug free, with all the mechanics that were in place, the best way, now wait, now prayer. A prayer will help you now. When you, you don't see the temptation, when you go the only bed, bed, pray. Pray 24 7. Now, only God, with everything else, what they do as government, let prayer be una number one weapon for stay drug free. Once you pray, you do already what tell you for do. Almighty God is says will help you now. Now only God will give you the trick. And we as a nation, as a government, we're ready for do any kind of thing in this country now. For make sure that Sierra Leone become drug free. For make sure that Sierra Leone continue to be a vibrant nation. Madam Chairperson, as they talked earlier, we all understand. That the five pillar agenda, number one, feed the nation. Who that get for feed the nation? Now the youth of this country. So we must continue for go after them. We must continue for faith hard, for save them. And by doing that, we will continue for save Sierra Leone and keep a happy Sierra Leone. Thank you. Let me get another hand. And tell Lieutenant Tenki for what he did on the front line. I've been there that day where they, they complain. And in fact, I think they were there outside the room. They refused to go inside for what the heat or the smell. And then somebody was talking about one, one meal a day, grana soup. I got for you say now when I, when I get beans. And where the minister, be, they say when I get three meals a day, I see some people they put up four fingers and say four meals a day. Yeah, so all of those on the front line need to be thanked. I thank you, mentioned.
Richard uh, Habib, I thank Habib. Habib Bea. Yes. Habib, where are you? Thank you, Habib, for, for joining the ministries on the front line. Now, okay, and he also closed with a very important point that continue to pray. Continue to pray that when our recovery sustained. Now we will go on to the clip, the video clip. We'll get the video clip before we get the next set of statements. Why is it that you know how to be a solid? 
requires everybody for being all their assets there and spent to the table. So that I make the end is excellent to say we get all of government approach. At the same time, we get all of society approach. So one of the things I want to mention is because we have a business with each other, some of you know only handle business. Where is somebody we can take them to six twelve years ago? Can they affect all the other in that employee? You know they do that. You see them, you have to pop, you pop, you pop, you pop, you pop for eighteen years, sixteen years, seventeen years, it costs them in their work. When you take this law, you go and they walk up here, and you pick in the air. So when you pop blood on your foot, you need to walk back and walk back again. So it's in the air. You put this way. But if you swallow the swallow of one of the eight, that's not what's going to happen if you get infected. When you take this next piece of law, you have to go in, you teach the law, the law, the law, you teach 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 the law, when you take this job, you can't be able to damage. When you take this job, or who can have to be able to get to the point where you can be able to get to the end of the illness. for the opportunity and also appreciate the government for this big opportunity and I want to tell my friends the mouth they are saying cushions of food and we need from abstain from the store because they destroy the life they did so it will impact them when I'm the store and this cush the life in this game will not be way more than I can see not be careful myself and I don't care about anybody else make 
I lost the spirit and good people and not push for me. So I thank God right now, I don't become a better somebody and become a person and tell Papa God thank you and government thank you for this opportunity. And I send advice to the confident outside, say, make the abstinence for this tour and this tour will not be fruitful because we lost the we need to be there outside and meet me. I don't lost my love one step at this door, but still I'm not blind and blessing for that. But since we are tired, I don't want to be seen. I don't want to go back to that corner. I appreciate it. The guy living against now because the government don't try. When they capture me, capture me, they have sent them. For me, it's not strong life. I appreciate the government for that. I'm not going to cry again. I don't need to cry. I'm not going 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 to cry. I
Quand elle est arrivée, elle est arrivée à un homme de guerre. 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 Yeah. I see it was the 
um, other ministers of government present, the members of the diplomatic corps, the EU ambassador, and um, our right hand partner, Nadia, always with us. Good afternoon. Um, we get for terrible thank you for a day like this. I remember when I present this thing in the cabinet, proceedings that the situation. I see president the way he take this thing. He feels very, very sorry. He say they were an victim. Lord, we treat them like an innocent victim. Lord, we try for redirect their life. We are clap for president the one. father of the nation. After that, we begin to gather people there. Because the law say, we you take our drugs, okay, it's a for charity for the court. But in the law, we go after the one the way they make them, they have the drugs, the one the way they bring and come, right. and the one the way they sell them. That's right. So then uh, we primarily target. They say that we are okay, they going to rehab center. We try to organize a life and make the land trade for two better things. So after accommodating, I said, firstly, I said, I want to see you, man. Now I said, I can't see me now. Now I go and meet her at the office. I said, you know, see, I don't get this appointment. Now I said, yes, I said, what is the biggest challenge? I said, my man, this push now, the biggest challenge now, and this government here, yeah, and this ministry. Now I said, what do you want? I said, I want to go now. All the districts. Make we raise a tax force to fight this push. That was last year. Now it's your turn. Now me will support this for fear. Una clap for first lady. First person we pull money for say let we begin fight push. You say that in your money this for fear. It will not be easy. We go now every district perform a tax force for price push from last year. We get up of good people then. But the November 26th event can overtake we. We give push now corner for us. By the time they got back again in January for the first push, they don't take a different tool. It not be easy. The Ministry of Internal Affairs for three months are not able to get rest for first push. That's the biggest problem. But we tell them thank you for the IG and the NDLA executive director, they not ever left me. Any cell I tell them, oh, they deal with me. The four people they turn on social media and say push the overtakes like that he. Chief Minister called me, and I said, Chief Minister, he tell me they call me now, I say, look the results. Who should they go down? That was bad. He said, wait I said, this thing will be on top of the situation. By February, the Ministry of Social Welfare, we hand over people to the facility. Let we do a pilot program with this one, then we see how we go able to react to the system. And today, we only see the result of this first program. Very successful. <laughs> Even the parents are very, very happy. So we want to tell God thank you for the government of Sierra Leone. We're not sit down and watch people that they die unnecessarily out of this push. Even now, as I speak, I don't tell the Minister of Social Welfare. For say, I get another badge where I want to send to you for rehabilitating them. I get them. Now, me, they pull them as it. I get them. If you want 400, 500 today, I will give you them. <laughs> we don't they try for rehabilitation, but we need for Kenneth Gunnar a center inside the, med the mental health workers and the social, the psychosocial counseling will be done, and then people that they will free from this drug. We get a very good number because the tax force, then at every village, every part of this country, we therefore pick out push. We don't get enough. So, Una, where they pass out today, Una don't be with ambassador. Una, no, inside the first day right now, the first day to the one that we bring a car. 
Una no usa una bilibaya. For le una help we for cut the chain of supply. Una get for lead we to the one that we the seller. So our development partners, please, whatever you should do to help us, please help us. It is not only peculiar to Syria, you know, that one I know. But because of uh, our current level, illiteracy, other issues, political, we don't want this to overtake any other issue. We want to deal with it as early as possible. So whatever help we do, please help us to get this thing out of the way. Once again, I want to thank all the ministers who are always put on for these things, who are always make this thing a success, the social workers, the mental health workers. I want to thank you all, and I pray say this first one, we will do more for bring people that can turn them to better matter man. They can only go right up. Nobody no go and see in the kind of situation here. So one make you all join around with me. They fight against push, not a political fight. They fight against push, not a regional fight. They fight against push now. All money fight. Now we all join hands together for fight against push. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you, retired uh, Major General. Yes, uh, I mean, actually, day that cabinet meeting, we a lot of people that we may condemn push takers. Well, it was the president himself that said. They are victims. And when you see the commander in chief, a retired brigadier general, put a retired major general in charge of the fight, who was no say we go from a Thank you, thank you, Major General. Now we'll continue with the statements. And I call on and from now we want to make the statements and be short, 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 short. Now the way they talk after, no, you know less important, but a lot of the points have been made. So if we can do that, short, 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 short. So the next speaker is the Minister of Gender and Children's Affairs. Dr. Fatima Madabio, colleague ministers here present, um, representative from the UN country of it, um, representative from the EU, ambassador, young boy and young girl, then, we mama them, on our cushion. I tell you, I thank for the camera I saw today. The first way we get against Kush, na first way na we all for one, not a one man fight. Now that make una if una watch around, we get plenty international organization the way they are so. We get plenty minister them for how serious we day as a country or as a government for making for fight against Kush. You know, as the Ministry of Gender and Children's Affairs, my ministry now we day for look at waiting women and picking and they go through and try for position we set for solving problem they make. When the fight against Kush begin, I begin discuss with my company then. Now cabinet with the top. What we meet with the top. We say this thing they don't pass my Because we begin see video picking them where they take Kush. We begin to see video of whom and them where they take push. Then we begin to say this he don't come up and play. So if I see not fire today, it better for me a day or so because we don't they try. Any time where women they suffer, begin and they suffer at the end. Young boy and young girl them where they take the kush. 
Some of them they picking them. And once they're affected by the homes, the picking itself they be di directly affected. So if they tell on their education, if they tell on their mental health, if they tell on everything about the picking them, the woman herself they suffer. So now that make inside February 2022, 2024, the ministry been joined the Ministry of Social Welfare for make we all tina tranga one for make we open the center now Hastings. Usa them been take some of with brother and sister them for rehabilitate them. We then pan this threat together, and uh, so we will end this threat together. After today, I think say we all when they are so, then don't refer to Una as ambassadors against Kush. Yeah. And make we all tie with Lapa, we Oja, and when we consist the stronger one for make we fight against them. The retired uh, um, soldier man he say. Una sabi the pot them. Una them in the cell them. Una lead me to them pot them in. Because, one, we get one big fet when I defect against poverty. That fet against poverty requires a young man and young woman for make we fet. We get the big, the, the big five game, game changers. When inside there, we flagship program na fit salon. Now, plenty opportunity they come. Agriculture business they can open at the country. If we not a young man and young woman, then how that they go there for go work? Una tell me back. Nobody no go there for work, not so. Yes, how we go pull with people and poverty? How we go make less cheap when I will eat in this country every day? Una let we think and let we do wise things then. When no go put we all pan problem. So now that make His Excellency the President. It, a wise man, you see, he declared on April 4th a state of emergency against drug and substance abuse. Because not to push one no more than the drug they embargo, all that drug then they where they embargo, in as much as push, and the most deadly one what we don't see so far, when the most devastating one, we they try for me to also look into the other drug then. When that make it for the listen news and watch television, we don't see they don't begin to clamp some of the people there when they, they supply and sell. When I lead with to them people and they make we able to get them for reduce or try for end substance abuse in this country so that with development go all water. Now that message I bring come for Una. We the woman then make we self the watch we begin them. Because in it better for them with parents to begin them better, better one. I don't see video them where I nearly cry. Two small, small bubbles less than 10 years of age. And they fed for Kush money. And he come and see that one day. He pathetic. So, on a layer we join them with the government, with any other person where we want for joining from this way. So, we go end the Kush in this country. I tell you plenty, plenty, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Isata, the children's protector. That we see. Yeah. Well, children's mother is over here as well, so it's I'm balancing both of them. Uh, the children's protector. Yes, you don't say make we watch we begin them. We need to take extra care of children. So I'll now call on the next speaker who is the representative from the Ministry of Health. We don't see the health consequences on the screen, so we need somebody from the Ministry who can talk and tell more details. Thank you very much, uh, our chair lady, Your Excellency, our First Lady of the Republic of Sierra Leone, Please allow me to turn on existing protocols. Um, I want to tell everybody thank you for giving this opportunity as a Ministry of Health for being part of this occasion. And we will not be part of our from the beginning. Um, I bring apologies from the Deputy 
Minister of Health, Professor Charles Senesi. We could only like be between uh, this afternoon, but because of an emergency we get enabled there. But uh, he thinks it is occasion very, very important, and the minister will be left out, so he asked me for kind of this afternoon. Me and uh, Dr. Asante Gisese, me and the director of non communicable diseases and mental health at the Ministry of Health. We therefore commend the rehabilitation centre, all the one that we work in, all the one that we provide support, financial support, material support, or make we see what happen today. If all of this is put together, enough of it is impossible. And I really want to commend the expertise and the professionalism way people that show at the rehabilitation centre. I'm very happy that they see we use them, see them, very good looking. Before this term, some of them be very stressed. Some be they cry. Some be get sore. Some be sick. But look at all of you today. You look very good. And all my know say, Una na ambassadors. Yes, Una ambassadors. Because Una get a very, very big task ahead of you. We don't go through the habitation. Now you're going back to your community. I don't want to assist them, I don't want to party them, I don't want to cause them. And um, this is the most crucial thing. And I want to appeal to you now, please, don't go back where you come from. Don't go back with the big. We know that addiction is very difficult. Addiction very challenging. But with your mindset, with the counseling, with the support you don't get, please don't go back. Because if you don't go back, all the efforts of the government, all the funds we don't make, it don't make any good to me. And when you see Her Excellency, the first lady, get them for cancer, don't have to talk with you now, for see you now. It tells us how dedicated, how the government, the Excellency, the President, take this thing very serious. We know say push a problem everywhere in the Sierra Leone. And then the interest is not just for town, but for everywhere. That is why we as a ministry, we don't take as a priority for ensure say we train mental health people there. Now each and every district and community. We they work with your partners there. And what it is not showing you today is um, this is the time we say if we work as a team, ministries departments, agencies, communities, partners, we can do wonders. All the one that we are the center, they are all serving us. Not so? Yes, sir. They are all serving us. That means we'll get the savvy people inside this country here. Yeah? But please, please, at the appeal to now, don't go back. And I want to assure us, say, we as a ministry, we go work with your partners there for prioritize one, prevention, we will prioritize um, treatment, we will prioritize providing support for anybody we need well body business in this country and for ensure say all men stay fit, stay fit and all men get a healthy life. Once more I will congratulate all of you and for please, please be very good ambassadors. Go out there and preach to your colleagues. Help your colleagues to come out of this menace. Talk to your people then, talk to your friends then. No go back, no go join them again, but bring them in they can join you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. So thank, thank you. Thank you, Doctor. Yes. We human capital development, we don't listen to the health consequences. We we don't learn say it will lead to Chris, it will lead to die. And message where Iggy don't go back. You've come this far, don't go back. Now we get another ministry under human capital development, way equally important, and that is the Ministry of Basic and Secondary Education. So I would like for call, sir, Mr. Conrad Saki, for make your statement. Madam First Lady, First Lady, um, 
Honourable Members, um, Ministers and Members of Parliament, um, Your Excellencies, Members of the Diplomatic Corps, Distinguished Ladies and Gentlemen, and Graduates. Let me... Sorry, I'll go back now. Like so, <laughs> let me first of all join all the other speakers here for congratulate all the one that we they come to the end of this program. And this, all the one that they come to the end of this program. Today, in this event, no two. <laughs> Today, in this event, not to the end of our journey. And definitely not to the end of our journey. Not only the start of our. Tomorrow, we all know what data this whole we do now. And una be una go be tempted or go back. But call that speaker and don't talk for that. Again. But I want to now always remember that we all go there now, we don't left, we own them, we don't left, we beg them, we can't now who is it make work do that. Now because we love now. Nobody know they use the word love, but me they use the word love. Now out of love make we there because we care for now. So on a member that day, where if one on a be tempted, that not on a no more than a struggle, we deal with you now. Let me also take the opportunity for telling you now what the new ministry go do for now. On Monday or the start of next week, we go contact all the ones who want to go back in education. We go do an assessment for make we know what we now on our plans. And then we will put a plan to make sure say we support now to achieve that, that plan. <laughs> like many other speakers that we don't talk before, I really want to take this opportunity for use now as ambassadors. Let me tell you now why. Now with school system in this country, we get 3.5 million people in this country. If we go share on a no personal story there, or we tell them because we are struggling them, and how we are not reach to this point, it will prevent them from make them consider for take kush. Even when they give them that kush, it will make them think twice before they go there. The best way for dealing with any drug situation, now not for start for take her. So it will find for make we work with you now. For make sure say we na be ambassador na we school them. Let me also take this opportunity for reminding all. Say we get to say in Africa we say if they take one old village, the papa them, the mama them, the uncle them, the auntie them, the brother them, the sister them, for raise Pekin. So we go continue for wrap around support for una. For make sure say una no go back. I wish you know, all the very best in this journey we una just start. To the audience, let me take the opportunity also for just mention a couple of things from an educational perspective. We don't hear mama and they can't talk, but they experience with um, picking away the and drugs. So we as a ministry get to work with mama and um, uh, and papa them for make sure say. They go able to identify them picking a way they get problem before they even begin to take drugs. Or they begin to take drugs so that we go able to make sure say we help them. The second thing also, we can introduce um, guidance and counseling back in our system. <laughs> that the only way that they will go able to identify picking them before they go into hard drugs and before they go into any problem. So guidance and counseling is very important. But we also need for also raise awareness of the beginning of the harmful effect of drugs and alcohol. Don't know for the alcohol itself. Because it's have take by the same thing. So in the next couple of weeks, we will work on some jingles. And if we are able to put on the jingles, that will be fine. We will work on jingles. Where we, go, where we go hear out that, that all the radio station there for make picking and not going to drugs. But finally, let me take this opportunity for thank all the other partners that we don't work with, they're picking it. 
and we all will continue to work, and we wish you now all the very best in this in our journey. Thank you. Thank you very much, Minister. Minister, don't tell when I say a love Una. And the a one for you, Una, as ambassadors, so be ready. And also, he wants to reintroduce guidance, counseling, and work with Una, uh, Mama and Papa then for see how Una go be reintegrated into the, the education system. But you have, um, from your, your, your ask, you already do have a wrap here. Um, so I think you think the rapper and the group and you already have a, a jingle. I think it goes along the lines that Kushi, Kushi is nonsense. So um, I think you should take the young man's name and the name of his group. Now we will go on to when our own minister. When our own minister and when our own ministry. And that's now the ministry of youth. Youth Affairs. So I will let Paul call the Deputy Minister for Khan talk to Una. Una Kabo. Hi, Excellency, the President, the, the First Lady, and all other ministers, them, colleague ministers, them, and the partners, them, whether they ensure, say, Thing go right with way. I want to say on a public that map now all the protocols that will be that they exist in this place. And I want to tell on probably today on open on eye on a senior like minister. The first day they go to now and they as they among on our with the talk on a not be no seven a minister here. Yeah? But today on a not see seven a minister. And they go talk to on a like we compi like we like on a compi. So what the day among on a that day. I they ask you now, what now we issues them, me and the minister. I mean, they talk to on that day, but I not go alone, I don't see me and minister. Because I go alone, I see me like one of them. And we at my peer, I mean, one of them. I mean, I man. So I want them to know, say, we get responsibility as youth man. Three days I not sleep, I didn't know on a highway. This early morning, I come, by four o'clock, I don't for camp for joy. The police and the tourism deputy minister take it to them. We will do a walk from your building to country for tell people they say the kush they don't take other level because if the kitchen now would they sell them or would they transport them or would you host the they sell them even if you know you host us that you host a they sell them or you rent depots a shop and they do kush business day on our own with the whole owner now. This now, now everybody with the whole. We're not the whole one person because we don't know say now a chain work. Because if you don't pour the fabrics of the young people that we for take over this country, then maybe you don't like yourself and you don't want salon for go before. We na youth ministry, like we at tell and say another sleep, I be there be a go na po, I go na real rock. I go talk to them, say do ya we get youth man them where they suffer for work. On a given place, and the only other for give over one thousand jobs for young people them. So when I we go reach that side in for let one get job, we they make an arrangement for let we ensure say we give one side for engage, because we no one left on that way day. Me na me na me you tina day for ensure say we get work for young man them. We present your appointment and then they need focus on how to get a job for young man. Then we give you a way I engage EU ambassador and they tell us, say, now this I want. I say, how we will we make sure say, the youth man in this country get work. So we don't also arrange now my, 90, my 91 Camp Charlie. We we'll try for arrange that place there. We we'll therefore reach out to partners that will ensure say, we we'll get all this place fixed. For ensure say we they take with my young man them they go. That place they take six thousand young man them at a go. For one go people they day for ensure say we train them at various various skills. We will make the come back na society they become valuable. And we want ensure say we don't write to bank governor. We don't tell us say do ya when I don't lend money other side. We want say when I get way how we for give young man the money. 
for letting themselves start their own business. One for entrepreneurialize the youth sector, me and my own dream down there before I left government. I want to see some young man them all man them into business. Because that one, when you don't get your own business, you need the paper person. I want to let everybody get your own business. Two weeks ago, I do a counterpart letter where Minister Nobody will be act as a minister for ensure we get we get a care for youth man them. And they tell them, I say, in less than three weeks, we they get 400 keke who they give people them. Wow. Now this country. And that keke who they give, one of the criteria now for good testing in our hospital, you know, they buy drug, and ensure, say, you know, mix by anything in the community, because the community is going to recommend you, and we're going to get stakeholders in the community, we're going to count them up as a guarantor for you. So that one day, it don't go through. I want to tell them, I say, you ain't not giving the young part of the funding because me and the picking and you and come on we are the kind of government. They don't give part of the funding. Government the young funding they they give it and we they ensure say we scatter the care and this town and beyond for ensure say so you ain't no say back. You know so they drive. We they put you. We we'll make sure say we we'll train you for right the care. Then we we'll give you the care if you feel say the care you want right. So you go to pay. 50% no more want. The other 50% mother be you say now on a get up, on a take up. So 50%. So you buy the care, 70 million. If you don't get license self, all arrange them. Make sure so you get licensed. The keke get licensed, we give you. So if now 70 million we spend 35,000, now you give government back because one user for buy other keke for other young man. Then you now you go with your life with that other one day. Now that drive will they pass. So in less than one year or two, in less than one year, six months, we want to entrepreneurialize the youth sector. And that day will they succeed. Yesterday we just got the jobs to young people there. And when I say we don't come also we find way how for put on our side, we will make we engage and the community will saw come on, we'll see on ourselves back as important people there. I want to say now we take this message, go other side, and all other, all other partners. Do ya? Me and the doctors, now they complete them, the mining complete them. For ensure, say let them give you space for young people. Then and ensure, say we 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 try for get most of the jobs them localized to your youth and the expert the two people in this country. One for ensure, say the train we we say we will take over them. And that drive right now, me they can move towards. So please, let us be of our mind. Let we do somebody where possible look and recommend you in the community. Go back as ambassadors. Now this I want to tell you now, go back in the community. Not go suffer again the community minister. Do your way go, behave like a youth man, behave like a young man, behave like somebody where matter be working with all the power in this country. For ensure say this, they make we look important now we with people there. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And thank you to First Lady and every other possible doctor for making sure say this youth man they come back in the community. I want to say thank you. Thank you very much, uh, Minister. But I don't talk too much with me, but the hope way the key is that they fight for jobs for youth man. Then we know able go um, job get jobs if for business money. But what the most important things are the first thing we is say we we is say we go to una una no no say we in a minister and that he be one of you or he's one of you. But I want to una also for go back with the thought that una one of una can be himself. One of una if una focus can also be a god. So it goes both ways. In case of you, but you want us today in your picture. So now we go to a statement from another government ministry, another important government ministry, Ministry of Local Government and Community Affairs, and the Deputy Minister is also here to make a statement. Thank you. Madam First Lady, we party them, we
we, you know, the international community where they support we, we come to minister them. And everybody we don't can here today for work we all of this great day. Me, we don't work for COVID before. But when Kush come, it frustrates me small. And we have the frustration of really being calm. Now we are beginning to see the so foot them. And we are beginning to see uniform man and soldier and police that sit up and they sleep. It begins to worry me. It moves from frustration to worry. Because then the people that now will be have a bar or will be have a bar, don't self, don't join his side. Kush. But Kush, now the first problem this will occur, even that myself suffer. This is the first sick waking at this country where the man self is suffer. Because then they go and bury the diamond at the graveside, but then they get the bone. So which means push the serious business and it burn. Because walk in the world bear with people then, we say with the gogi we find a respect. But it looks like when Kush come, it takes down the wing. So we ambassadors them. Now this is one for say to Una. Una stay together. We Una left here today. Una stay together. Una get any WhatsApp group as ambassadors? Una not get it, eh? I'm going to encourage Una for make Una get that. What do you do? We are need for stay together because we are not in a one community. So that if some problem can of one community, we are all be zero in that, on that community there and trying to solve the problem. The other thing where I will tell one of the ambassadors, we are stay united. Because we are there together, but we are not united. And I the hope say, with everything, with all the partners that we, when are the uh, real ministry and development partners that don't put together, and which they provide for Una this last few weeks, for them make Una stay united. <laughs> but also, I want to make Una take the level. Because your man, they will go back now, so I make Una back home. He said, well, let me go, give me the kush. Now when you don't you don't so much small, that that makes you want to make big man like that. So take the label. Take the label as a badge of honor. Because what you do, you give yourself the opportunity for making you go through the rehabilitation. Will not be easy at all. So if you come out and somebody they tell you, say, but you come on and have yourself in the video, take push. Take that label. Because that label there and the experience and everything that don't go through. Now that they take that the community for them to go talk to the people then. When President Bill declared a push as a national emergency, I tell myself, say, well, the end of Kush don't count in this country. Why make I talk so? Not only because the president talk about, but because I know where COVID be the above all sides of the world. Where the big countries like America and China, where COVID be there and them, and when see the experts, they say, they say, where in Canada, Africa, COVID go make we all go just before them and die. Where President Bill will stand up and stand against the fight, we all see how we take COVID go. And here is what in the world they look for. Both first COVID, other countries that are the world, they will be they use Salo as an example. BB countries that like America all because of the way we will handle COVID. And that's not the reason why I make where I say, when His Excellency declare a national emergency on substance and drug abuse, then with special focus on Kush, I tell myself, say, no. Kush, you get for go. 
Uh, the minister about there today, the Honorable Ambassador Tambalamina, uh, and some of those who they deal with chief there, local government and community affairs. So a day by one engagement, we're there for deal with chief. But that's not very important. But any fish you don't hear, you don't grow past me own. So he said, if me can, when I go see some day with you now, much more than you go there with you now, look at it in a grandpa. So that I make it say back again. Tell what I say. In a cobra, this year they make itself self get pain in my heart. Because as papa, he get picking them. And when it happen to Una, you know what for making it happen to any cobra, you know what for making it happen to Una at all. So he message to Una like this. So do ya as if you don't see that video. Well, that they say no to Kush, make Kush go, we not stay with that message day, and we not help in the fight for end COVID. Wait till me go. Wait till me go end up for tell on her. Kush, not to the no more idea. After three day, na Pendembo, Mio hometown, in Kailan district. Policeman, they hold your man with a brain can and the host. Whether they can't go to the police, we get pushed in hand. So, as a ministry, when they deal with community affairs, we want to tell the Minister of Social Welfare and all of the other ministers, the way they join and participate, say, Ministry of Local Government and Community Affairs, they with Una, we will fight together and we will stand with Una. The ambassadors there. I'll tell you now, thank you. Thank you. Uh, I want to tell the, the minister, thank you. Two points. One, he say that the one sick way they affect both the living and the dead. When are true. The second point, he reiterates, say, he took him back, say, Una for be ambassadors. I think say every speaker don't say this. But one thing I want to say about this ambassador business, when I get for work day and net. But what I hear, first lady, the reason why we don't see so many people out nodding in the day uh, on the street is that they may sell now the sellers refuse for sale during the day so that the person will and catch. They don't go ask who does sell this drug to you. So what do they do now? Then they sell the drug at night. So they then have their own Yes, that's what's happening now. So if you then have your own, you did take the drug, you did not, nobody not really see. So really, as ambassadors, you get for work, when I get for work, they next. Not to just the data uh, uh, drug takers, but the ones at night, and there are more takers at night. So when I get woke up, okay. So the next week, you ready? Yeah. Great, great. Okay. So the next speaker now, we don't we don't uh, talk, uh, but one retired uh, uh, um, soldier man way there from this bed. We don't get another one way talk. Now we get get an active. Uh, and the fact that you don't, uh, 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 when I don't get an standing ovation, me say you don't walk with you. And walk with, and walk with you now, well, well, one. So, it gives me the honor for Paul, Colonel Brewer. Thank you, Madam Chairperson. Our Excellency First Lady Dr. Fatima Bio, please let me respectfully stand on existing words. I will say an apology for boss, one of the deputy minister of defense, we not there, you see like a presenter, 
actually on another tax we imagined for him. I want to say on behalf of the Deputy Minister of Defense, the Senior Management of the Republic of the Sierra Leone Armed Forces, I want to extend first of all with thanks to Witadi Wipa, His Excellency, Brigadier General Rita Bonotaya, <laughs> Papa Madabio. Salute to the salute to the survivor. Yes, salute the survivors. We papa, he take this initiative for taking her out of the street. And he look and say, in a soldier man, a soldier man best go do this job. Now, me the landlord, a blanc see tenant, but this is one of the worst tenants they were getting initially. Then I give God the glory because it not be easy. But me was, you have to go repair me glass them. You have to repair me sealing them. Hello? But I want to thank God because these people, this will pick them, the way they go, and the way God transform them. I just want to give God the glory. Yeah. One day, if they team up, if they took in the water around me, I will not make you see me. You see, you wish, you remember the other day when we go to um, Bintumani on this same push program and processes. You said, hey, I wish me mama been day for let's see what don't revive, what it transform. When you talk that word, water around me, I will not make you see me. I mean, I saw the heart for cry. I don't cry, but you attack one me. I want to tell you, see you, Mama, they see you. If you left Kush, look the mommy there, look at them, Boko. Mommy Fatima building, I am. Look at my family there, they all over we. Hello? Hi. Oh, Mama, they don't tire for cry. They don't cry a lot. Even when they do, oh, you watch the film now. I've been watching. So, Mama, they want to want their eye. Oh, no, the ambassadors they now. If you go back, you go bring each one, save one. And they assure this country, see, in the space of six months, push the donors alone. Because you, you, you get the reality of it. You don't see, you don't experience her. You don't see how you brother them die before you. And you self don't see how they feel. And to now, you don't transform and be a push free person. When you go back to the, to the, to the push ghettos, you explain to them. Indeed, they will take you with all due respect. And indeed, you will convince them, is it a better than possible? No one to take coach. Because you don't feel it, and you don't come. I want for advice, say, as soon as they go, when I promise me, not the boss, say, when I not going to take coach anymore. Not too soon. Yeah. Yeah. And we pray. We all pray together. I pray that as soon as they go, God will go before them. Amen. Yeah. The Bible says, Psalm in Isaiah 45, verse 2, he said, We'll go before you and they'll make the cooked past straight. Because they don't talk a lot about prayer. The youth only to pray, it will be difficult in your life. Some of you in our prayer put you in our today. We see the war, we fight, we fight the war, we let them pass, pass for me. And I ever pulled me, my foot to side pass, it was the grace of God. So if God can deliver me from war, it could deliver me from Kush. Yeah. Yeah. You and the ambassador, you are the ambassador now go for go and preach the good things where Papa Bio don't do for you. I want for end for tell me, Mama, thank you for we left in busy schedule. I talk to Doctor Mama Fatima for we left in busy schedule for Kanaya. Yeah. That for tell you how important it take una and how important it concern. But this killer drugs will call Kush. I want to thank you all for your keen attention. Thank you. That now when I when I mentor. And, yes. and one thing, since when I recognize 
we not care for follow through on that promise that we are not going to take kush anymore. Because in way don't take with one every day and it don't see one transformation. A gladi and he pray God that he go make one cook, cook a path straight. <laughs> so not let him down. And also when that repair bill from Madam Meros, I don't know. Well, now your ministry subvention, Madam Meros, the repair bill from you. Yeah. That's your own ministry subvention, eh? No. Or, or all the ministries should chip in. Okay. All right. So we get one last uh, representative from the various ministries. And why we get so many speakers, as, as uh, we would all say from the beginning, there are so many ministries and so many sectors involved. So I will let you call on the representative of the Ministry of Higher and Technical Education.
This one now they tell me professional head for social welfare. I say, do you I want one space. Because that young woman, he get potential. This thing not for one so. On a few things on a long done the outside. Now the difficult side on a the can go back. Because even the Bible talk and say, when one demon come out, if they won't get that in company, then they can't mobilize for enter. So do you have a thing called Beguna? You see what he make at the guy he sings a lot of about God thank you. Because now God no more now with everybody's face. Yeah. For me, one thing when we know, as long as we papa don't hold and we do it, we go fetch this face. Do ya? Go now, they go now for me today. We take God be good because the work you know don't need to now now una they go because you go see don't what you want the way nobody know they that voice go they talk like yes man then they wait till they have in they man then go make the thing small no when it can't pass down this time's nothing between you me and god for talk to god lead on a god cry to god if you give the concept come on at the neighborhood where you know say that thing will make you feel that way they push for body Keep your mind busy. Please, at the big one. Una na the future. Eh, if you lost una, what will happen? If you lost una, 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 but who don't go? If you na fast the thing down the line, five, ten years down the line, you will look for a lot of money, no, we'll see. But to me, I stand with una at una sister. And with all the people that we the not talk. And with mama, we sit on a yard. Mami Fatima, sky for me. Because most they tell me, police big person, she don't this hour, they wait for the in last stop. It means say, it means the immediate in her heart. Let God bless you. Let God bless Fatima for me. Let God bless Una self for me. Because now Una now got to go, tell the message, go say, you see, if I survive her, you simply survive. I know they talk for more. But I know so Una get to see some of you back again. Because Una, some of you, we are the family. Thank you very much. Thank you. This is other mama, the talk where this Kush business don't touch your heart. As a ministry, we say that they go out for them couple for support their young people then let Kuna set on education. They emphasize way the Pa, mommy, the go worker, not for enjoyment. And for go talk on behalf of this nation. For go cry, owners, partners, and other governments for help this nation. What he also say that he pray God for now. But we not say, 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 get for resist temptation. And the way we when I resist temptation, they say, go down on our knees and pray. Prayer don't come back, come up in almost every talk. So it's very important. Ambassadors, when I want that drink, pray. Now we don't come to another important part of the program. Statements then don't done except for the big statement where we get forget shortly. We they can't get a performance by the service users. We they can't get performance, I believe, by the graduates. Sure. Yeah, that's it. Mm -hmm. So, you know, say it's a Saturday afternoon, eh? So, five minutes. Five minute performance. All ministers, everybody present here, of course. Um, Mr. and Mr. Stand on existing protocol. For tell each and everybody say, of course, Lamps and P. Um, I don't establish my multimedia house because Mr. and Mr. Join up our government for fight this fight. The multimedia house, they give free training to push victims and all our vulnerable youth. 
So, uh, First Lady, Ministers, other partners, I will achieve this, but I will achieve 100% without you. Sir. God bless you. So, now we get the performance. Yes, we get the performance. Yes, we get the my excellencies, ladies, partners, ladies and gentlemen, we get a small performance with Wagyuna. These are the music we see, Kush Mosku, Baba Itu Kush, and Kush Mosku. We like it all. We go. We come and say, we don't go get your mindset. Okay, how are you start? Everybody say, bye bye to Kush. Bye bye to Kush. Bye bye to Kush. Bye bye to Kush. Yeah, yeah, start the intro, man. Okay, now we're the intro. This is not bad habit. Dog addict. This is not bad habit. Dog addict. Make papa crabby. Will you pray for some sex? Some man and they make no sense. Brother, if it's more crucial, it no make sense. I say, will you pray for some sex? Some girl and they make no sense. Sister, if it's more crucial, it no make sense. President Joseph Kush must go. Shusha welfare them say Kush must go. The minister them say Kush must go. And the other them say Kush must go. So the youth man them say bye bye to Kush, bye bye to Kush, bye bye to Kush, bye bye to Kush. Kush must go, bye bye to Kush, bye bye to Kush, bye bye to Kush. I say Kush must go, bye bye to Kush, bye bye to Kush, bye bye to Kush. Now Kush make I lost me work. Now Kush make I lost me idols. Now Kush make me party pool pet now. As if I was on my loneliness. Now Kush make I know I live better life. Now Kush make me party die wasting life. So me no want no more. No more. Mr. President, I promise you, Kush will not smoke no more. No more. I say we don't want no more. No more. No minister, I promise you, Kush will not smoke no more. No more. We pray for success. Success. No man, let it make no sense. No sense. Brother, if smoke Kush, it don't make sense. I say we will pray for success. So I'm glad that it make no sense. Since time this more push it don't make sense. President Bill say push must go. Church and wife brother them say push must go. The minister them say push must go. And the other them say push must go. So the youth for them say bye bye to push, bye bye to push, bye bye to push. I say push must go, bye bye to push, bye bye to push, bye bye to push. Baba to push you go on say I go back in the morning I will am na here go off from I will go am push you put am go here na put there pick up the gas ha ma follow get it be e go at the you go at the I will go I Push it every hour, giddy, and then every partner press them. You get out that oil. We need to submit it to the gaster, that oil. Should you have to the gaster, that oil? And then you get out of the gap. Bye bye to push. 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 Bye bye to I she don't be say request for the sake of her love of her. If not for my sake or for the sake of the children, if she don't come back, no problem. I don't feel that I'll go. Queen Storm Fatimata, we say, I make she come back home. I never intend to do my work. So for the sake, I say, Kush must go. Hey, I say, Kush must go. Hey, we say, Kush must go. Hey, we say, Kush must go. I like to push. 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 I like to push.
I say I don't want no more. Mr. President, you promise to say push you and I smoke no more. I say we don't want no more. No more. Minister, we promise to say push you and I smoke no more. put on ourselves together and compose this. Push must go. Go back to nonsense. Okay, now we get another important activity, that is program, and this is the handover of service users for reintegration plan. We have to do this one. Okay. Thank you very much, Chair. Hi, Excellency, the First Lady, Honorable Ministers, Distinguished Guests, we now have or stand on existing protocol. We are Anzu Kone, I'm the Director of Mental Health and Psychosocial Support, my Minister of Social Welfare. Kush was good. 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 Well, the task now is a, a, very, a very short and simple for car handover with service users. We don't discharge from the rehab center. See, but I get a round of applause for we, We're glad it today because the model we use now three R model: reintegration, recovery, rehabilitation, recovery, and reintegration. So now that stage it don't begin now. As somebody we don't say, this is not a starting point. So because I don't go through a lot, this is not just a starting point. So now I left on so I glad the way other ministers that don't talk about this plans we're gonna get for now. So we get our big data today, we we'll already share. So when this program done, for start of the process, we get a small package for now. When I see some bad day and so each person get bad now. Because for the past seven and a half weeks, when I don't eat three times a day, and see, when I wash, when I sleep. We don't want to go today, tomorrow, when I grab, when I surprise, no? So get, see the whole call, discharge, keep the phone. So get toothpaste, toothbrush, bathing soap, laundry soap. We go and say, people get condoms for one. Don't get condoms inside. Patch for condoms. We get one of your organization with social linkages. Thank you, they get condoms in the phone, specifically. Social in case they get a condom the specific phone. Then also surprisingly, we get a bag of rice each phone. Then the last the last surprise. The last surprise. Through after sale, we don't all get more iPhones. Yes. So we we all team done. Um, the honorable minister of social welfare. We get for officially hand over all the assets to Tuna. So I want to wish you all the best, and want to make sure that all the things on Tuna I have when I listen. Thank you very, very much. I want to tell Ministry of Social Welfare thank you on behalf of the the graduates, not 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 victims anymore. And um, uh, I notice I notice a uh, Madam Minister. That bag of rest, you don't go with one bag beach, they're going to miss that beach. <laughs> so now we come to the highlight of the program. <laughs>